I was a musician. I played um, bass guitar in a disco band and I had a motorbike accident and couldn't play anymore. But in the meantime, I had started uh, making things for fun. Now, those things um, started selling and it was really through um, the idea of, of um, me changing from my hobby to my profession um, that I became a designer. So um, the things that I made started to sell really rather well and it took over from a music career, almost by accident. I like to think that there's a recognisable sense of Britishness about what I do and that really means that quite simple shapes and some really solid materials and an aspect of improving with age. I mean I like to think that uh, my objects are made in a solid enough way for them to look better once they've been used. You know? So um, I think we're, we're talking about things which have um, probably a sculptural silhouette and I'd probably describe it as expressive minimalism. Being a designer is a kind of interesting um, career because it sort of changes according to every project that you do. As a designer you have to increasingly be um, somebody who, who does more than just make the shape of an object. You have to also be somebody who's interested in the factory or the manufacturing process. You have to be somebody who's interested also in who buys your, your, your products and you're increasingly somebody who communicates about the, the stuff as well. So um, on one day I might be a market person, I might be a business person, a sculptor or a factory engineer. You know? So that's interesting and then on top of that I've made my own brand where I can now be a perfumier one day, so designing through my nose. Um, or I can be a lights designer, designing lighting effects, or I can be somebody who's making new shapes in chairs or in um, cookware, for instance. You know? I've always been interested in the way that things are made. So my design always comes from an interest in the manufacturing techniques um, and the materials that, that we use. You know, the job of a designer is almost like a alchemy, it's turning materials into gold, you know, so making things more desirable, making them more functional and just improving them in any way you can. 